In this tutorial, I will show you how to install IntelliJ 2022.2.3 for Java FX uh, 19. Let's go to IntelliJ website, download, latest version, download. It may take uh, um, two minutes to download. Once you download it, you can double click. So they can start to install IntelliJ. Run it. Next. This is where we are going to install IntelliJ. Next. I will create a desktop shortcut. Next. Install. Finish. Let's create a new project. We are using JavaFX with uh, Oracle JDK 19. I'm not using any additional library, so next. Close it. By default, it's going to use a Maven build. Project consists with a Hello application, Hello controller Java, then Hello view. Let's go to build. Then run it. Here is the uh, sample JavaFX application with the JavaFX 19. Okay, next one I will show you how to use uh, JavaFX in Builder. So first time you need to set a uh, Java FX Sim Builder. Right hand side mouse click, open in Sim Builder. We should be on the hidden folder. So just turn it on. You should be under your username, app data, local. Look for Sim Builder. And then select simbuilder.exe. Okay. You just need to do that only once. Okay, now it's uh, launched simbuilder. Let me change the text message to be to Java FX 19. Go to code. You can add the FX ID for object name, button hello. Save it. Now let's build it again. On it. So it works exactly the same. This time it will show the different label, JavaFX 19. Okay, now we are going to look at how to do programming without model. So model info Java remove it. Project structure. Default library is based on Maven build, so let's remove it all. Okay, we are going to add JavaFX library. It should be on the program files. Java, JavaFX SDK 19 and select library. Okay. Okay, this is where I have a JavaFX SDK library. O apply, okay. Wait for the file. 
your project should be able to locate JavaFX libraries. Let's build project. Okay, that's successful. Let's run your project. It says that JavaFX runtime components are missing. Because we need to set up new configuration file for this project. Let's click add new run configuration. Select application. Application name, I will say app. Build and run default. Main class, you select hello application. OK. Options, add VM options. You need to tell your project you are using external Java library. In this case, we are looking at module paths and then location to your JavaFX SDK libraries. So all of them. Copy. Paste it. Add modules. We are using two additional libraries. JavaFX controls, JavaFX FXML. Apply. OK. Let's try again. OK. Great. Seems like OK. As you can see, we are using module paths. Then uh, add modules with uh, two additional JavaFX libraries. Yeah, this is how you can use uh, JavaFX 19 with IntelliJ. That's all. Thank you.